Now, sometimes vegan food gets a bad rap for being slightly boring. However, I have the king of vegan food here. He knows his stuff. Shanika from Lentil as Anything. Hey, hey. Yeah. <laughs> you make fantastic curries. Tell me a little bit about what we're going to be making today. Thanks, Justin. Well, this is a Senegalese curry. Mm. Uh, I didn't know curries existed in Senegal, but yeah, there here you we go. go. And uniquely, they add peanut butter to the curry. Now, Shanika, there's a lovely array of vegetables here in this curry. What's the first step? Well, you can start with the crushing of the peppercorns, sure onion and garlic. Nice. And so whole peppercorns. Yes. You want them to be whole to start with, is it because you want some more texture in it? That's right. Mm -hmm. And just uh, crushing the onions slightly so that we help it mingle with the peppercorn. Nice. Make friends with it. Exactly. All right, we'll put that straight into our mortar and pestle. And some garlic. And some garlic, okay. yes. Very important ingredient in curries. Absolutely. So, Shanika, lentil as anything, it's not your average restaurant, is it? Well, it's not, because we don't have fixed prices on the menu. Mm -hmm. You can contribute anywhere you want. Right. Uh, and usually... Monetary or, or by giving back to the community, giving back to the restaurant in a way. That's right, you can Fabulous. volunteer. There are a range of ways you can be involved. And you'd think that'd be quite hard, but you've been doing this for 18 years and the model works, doesn't it? It works beautifully. It is really about focusing on sustainability um, and creating opportunities for the community to participate. And of course you go there and eat the most delicious vegan food. We've got the crushed Peppercorns, are you happy with that? That looks amazing. With the garlic yep. and the well onions. Done. You can get on to chopping up those zucchinis. You can. Generally, we try to use what is seasonal mm -hmm. so that it's not food traveling from thousands of miles away. Yep. Because we are conscious of sustainability and of you know, help the local growers uh, and farmers uh, yep. as well. Okay, so we start with a little bit of vegetable oil. Okay. And uh, get that nice and hot. Let's add those onions in there. And how long are we going to fry that off for, Shanika? Just, just for about two minutes. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's it's a heavy nice, one. heavy mortar and pestle. <laughs> Luckily, I did my weights this morning. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now we add our tomato paste. Yep. Yeah. Nice. Lots of tomato paste for this. Yes, nice, rich and thick. Mm -hmm. Give that a bit of a stir. Nice. All right, and so now the essential ingredient peanut butter. Mm. I like using the smooths um, peanut butter because it just uh, spreads a bit mm. nicer. It's like an instant thickener too, right? Yeah. Okay, Justin, mm -hmm. now we can start adding the vegetables. Okay, so... Um, you can add the sweet potato. I tend to add the, the firmer vegetables first. Absolutely. Some pumpkin, all Some pumpkin. chopped the same size. Yep. There we go. That'll do. And some carrots. Oh, I mean, you know this is going to taste nice. Look at these colours. Yeah. And some potatoes. How did you want me to chop them? Um, just dice, just like Same the sweet size? potatoes. Can yes. Do. So a few potatoes. Yes. There we go. Potatoes Wonderful. In. Okay. So next, you want to add that eggplant in. Eggplant in. And then we've just got space for all our beautiful zucchini. Are we adding any liquid to this at all? Yes, we are. We're going to add some water just to help the vegetables cook down. Okay. Huh? So you say when. Um, yep. Done. That'll do. <laughs> Fabulous. And, and let's give it a bit of a stir. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're going to cook this down for about 15 minutes. Yep. Um, I'm just going to add some salt. Of course. And then uh, we'll just put the lid on and uh, let it... Let it do its thing. Let the fire on the pan dance. Fabulous. That's a nice way to say it. <laughs> All right, Chanika, drum roll, absolutely. This curry's been cooking for about 15 minutes. Oh, it smells divine, doesn't it? It smells beautiful. Mm. So this is just a fantastic dish for the kids yeah, as well. Absolutely. Because uh, it's just yeah. got the simple peanut butter and tomato base. Fantastic. And is this on all the menus at Lentil as Anything? Well, we rotate our dishes. Yeah. So you'll find this available in our St Kilda restaurant during mm -hmm. winter. Yep. Otherwise, we'll come to your house and make it for you. Or come on your cooking show. Exactly. <laughs> How lucky am I? And let's dig in. Mmm. Wow. It's incredible. Mm, the sweetness of the sweet potato and the pumpkin. 
but then all of a sudden you get a lovely nuttiness from that peanut butter. Yep. It's a nice, simple dish that has lots of character to it. It does. And like Shanika said, the kids are going to love that curry. Absolutely yes. awesome. Yes. Mm. Yummo.